Hello, it's Sarah, and I have a haul video. It's milk glass. Um, I went to a thrift store today. I was on my way to Hobby Lobby, and you know on your phone you have, well, I have an iPhone, and on your phone you have that, it's not Google Maps, it's that other maps. I don't know if you can see that. I'm gonna mess up my focus. But right here, when you hit that, Anyway, I had entered in um, thrift stores before. I was just, I was like sitting on the couch and I just entered it in. And like all these little pins come up of the ones in your area. So I was like, oh, cool. So then I kind of knew what was going on. And there's one a block away from the Hobby Lobby, like from the street that Hobby Lobby's on. It's like a couple of miles probably from Hobby Lobby, like two miles from there. Um, so I did a two for one today. I wanted to show the milk glass first because um, I didn't get very much at Hobby Lobby. I was really just going for um, like uh, flower centers. That was my main objective and trims and stuff like that. Um, so I'll show you, I just have a few things. Oh, the tablecloth by the way was $3.99 at this thrift store and it's eyelet and it's like, it's an ivory color or um, antique white, and I really like it as a tablecloth. I feel bad, I mean, it's on my table, and I'm not shabby chic up here. Like, it's definitely not, um, it's more country. I am not shabby chic at all around here, and I don't think a tablecloth, like, it just looks better with the raw wood. But um, I just put it on here just for, <laughs> you know, to show, because I love it, it's $3.99, and, Look at all that eyelet, so that was good. All right, so here's my first piece. This is kind of, um, I I told you, I'm not gonna get everything I see. I want the like different kind of pieces or the useful pieces, but this one was so neat. This is, um, it was $1.50, and it has like, people are sitting at a table on here, and they kind of seem like they're German. So this might not be it, like, a American made piece. I don't know. But like, cause it looks like they have um, ale mugs on the table and stuff. But see it has that, no, that's not that. I don't know. I'm gonna have to look on eBay and stuff and see if I see this particular um, like style on there and um, see if I can figure it out. But I just really liked it. It was what, it was $1.50. So that was cool. I didn't really have anything that shape or size. So I got that today. I got my first piece of Fenton. This was uh, marked down. It was $7.99, but it was $3.99. So I got it. I mean, I don't really need any more of these like open. I kind of want, um, I don't know what I want, but I couldn't resist. It was $3.99 and it's the hobnail, I guess. And it has that, uh, you know, the ruffled edge and everything. And I mean, I guess it's just like a candy dish. But for $3.99, I really couldn't pass it up. So I got that. And then this one was super different too. This one was $2.99. And I think I know why. Because I found right on this little lip here, there is a chip. I mean, it's very hard to notice. When I was washing it is when I noticed it. Because I did not notice it in the store. But this has like um, dogwood flowers on it or something like that. And I hadn't seen that pattern before. Um, so it does have this like starburst on the bottom. And I do have another piece with the starburst. So maybe it's another manufacturer, but I just couldn't resist. This was um, $2.99. And I just thought that is such a nice size piece. And it has like a ruffle. I don't think it's Fenton though, um, but it's really pretty. I like it, I'm happy with that one. So I got that. Then this was like 79 cents. I don't know. I just thought it was cute and different again. It has this swirly pattern all over it. It's just simple. It's just a little dish. But for 79 cents, I thought that was cute. I could just use that on my desk. Or I might just start using this stuff around the house too. Like once I, uh, this one is cool. This has like a quilt pattern on the bottom. That's what I really fell in love with. I have another, another like a round piece downstairs that kind of has these bumps on it too around the lip. Um, but this has like a quilt pattern on the bottom. Let's see how much this was. $1.50. I 
I mean, you can't, this is the most fun shopping ever when everything's $1.50. I mean, I'm really trying to stick to under five, like under five if I really want it, but I like to go for two or even less, you know? But that is super cute. I really love that um, quilt pattern under there with like the flowers, the dots. So I got that. And then today I also got this one, a creamer. And they had the matching sugar bowl. This was 95 cents, but I didn't get the sugar bowl because I thought the one I had matched it, and it doesn't. This is the one I had. I just brought this from down. See, this is another one with that starburst on the bottom, um, but it's different. This is like, this is like a layered brick or something, this pattern. It has like, it's like, you can see it better there, like how it's like lays, layers of brick. Um, and this is just bubbles layers of bubbles so but I would use them together I don't care I think they look super cute together so I mean I don't I don't need matching sets or anything like that I'm really more after the price and like the find and the different something different so I really I just I'm happy now I have a bowl a sugar bowl and a, and a, and a you know creamer now these I got yesterday 50 cents for both 25 and 25 and this matches the um, other pieces I have downstairs with the oak leaves and the grapes so that is but this is different from my other cup that goes with the um, luncheon plate so this is still has the oak leaves and the grapes and it was 25 cents so I couldn't beat that 50 cents for that and that was over here right around the corner for me there's a place called Kathleen's closet and I didn't even know it was a thrift store, but then uh, taking a better look, I look and it's like this little thrift store. So, and then this is my final one. I got my first vase. This was from Goodwill and it was a dollar. It was 99 cents. And I just liked it because it was bigger. See, there's that starburst again. So several of them have that starburst. Um, so I guess they may be, but see, it's a different size starburst too. Um, but anyway, uh, it was different from the other, the bud vases are too small. Like this is big enough that you could like, both of these are kind of comparable in size for you to like put stuff in, like even pencils or pens, or I don't know. Um, I just loved it. I thought it was for a dollar. I mean, and I love the darker milk glass color too. So I got that. So those are all my milk glass finds. I'm, I'm like thrilled. This was $16, well, $16.50. Well, 16, 17, 18. So tw 20 bucks for two days and all these, all this milk glass and $4 for the tablecloth. Um, anyway, so these are the pieces real quick that I got at a Hobby Lobby. Half price today. These will definitely make good flower centers. So I was very pleased with that. This was half price. That can be used for flower centers. This one was super cool too. I love that big pearl. And this was the only one of these or I would have gotten a couple because I love these. And then I just got some buttons because I saw a super cute tutorial last night by um, Tosh. Ugh, something, uh, something in Seoul. Oh, I don't remember, but she was making these little pin cushions and I'm totally going to make them. And then this, Wings Applique. I couldn't resist. It was $3.99. But I could just see one of my dolls with these wings on, on a shabby chic project. And I'm so looking forward to using them with one of my dolls. And some of my buttons, my shabby buttons. And, you know, I'm having fun, guys. This is cool. It's fun getting into a new thing. So you change it up a little bit. All right. Well, that's my haul. Thanks for watching.